Good morning, everybody. I'm in Pine Mountain, Georgia, inside of the 2016 Mega Event Going Caching. This morning, there'll be a flash mob, which we'll all be wearing our time travel gear. I'll show you guys pictures of that and video. And then there's plenty more. I think they're releasing their lab caches later this afternoon. And that's coming up next. have been warned <laughs> so if they run out it's their fault <laughs> again we are very glad to have you back and hopefully the next time you come we will have a place for breakfast <laughs> at least a cup of coffee and a donut maybe I don't know where our Again, welcome to Warm Springs, and I have a proclamation that I'd like to read for you. Whereas the city of Warm Springs, Georgia, with its unique charm and historic downtown, 
lends itself to exploring on a grand scale, and whereas the city of Warm Springs is deep in historical significance, witnessing many events that have impacted and shaped not only the United States, but the world. And whereas the city of Warm Springs welcomes visitors from far and wide to explore its history and its charm, and whereas geocaching is a globally recognized outdoor adventure activity involving people of all age ranges and walks of life, and whereas the many recreational, educational, and helpful benefits of geocaching are widely recognized, and whereas over a thousand ge geocachers from 30 states and several countries will gather for over four days in the surrounding area, come together to attend the geocaching mega event, going caching, and whereas geocaching headquarters based in Seattle, Washington, has sent its representatives to witness this event and enjoy all that Warm Springs has to offer. Now therefore be it resolved, I, G. Robert Prater, Mayor, on behalf of the City of Warm Springs, do hereby proclaim October the 10th, 2016, 2016 as Geocaching Week. There are two other people here that we need to recognize and give you a warm welcome. First, our, the chairman of our county board of commissioners, Ms. Beth Headley, is here. She's also a shop owner. And I must part of comment, give you a warm welcome from the great county of Maryland. Good morning. It is wonderful to see all of you here and welcome to Meriwether County and of course to Warm Springs. Warm Springs is home to me. I just cannot tell you how much this does for my heart to see this many people in Warm Springs. We hope you enjoy your day here, your time here in this area, and we hope that, you, that you'll certainly come back to see us because we're going to launch something here in Warm Springs next year that we we'll hope you'll be interested in. And our chamber president will tell you a little more about that. But again, welcome to Warm Springs. Welcome to Meriwether County. Carolyn McKinley is the president, I guess, of the Meriwether County Chamber of Commerce and has been very active and involved in moving us forward as far as our tourism programs here in with County of Warm Springs. And I'll ask her to give you a welcome from the chamber and I think she has some announcements to make also. Good morning. Good morning. I tell you what, I have not been this excited in a long time. Well I take that back. Maybe when we launched our uh, event at Lake Merriweather for our zombie themed geocache. Exactly does a steampunk time travel costume look like? 
And so I had to do a little Google search, and yes, indeed, I see a lot of y'all ordered from that Google search because y'all y'all know how to dress in steampunk time travel, and we could not be more thrilled to host y'all, to welcome y'all, to invite y'all, to see and do everything there is to do in Meriwether County. Now, does this look like steampunk time travel? No. no. All right, what this is is our next uh, geocache that we're going to be launching here in Warm Springs, and it's going to be based on the Marvel characters. So this is our work. in Warm Springs. And, and if y'all will leave us your email addresses or we can maybe get them from Andy or Jim, we would love to let y'all know when we're ready to do that. The other one we're going to be launching is one in Manchester right down the road that's based on their railroad theme. So we have seven cities in Meriwether County and our goal by hopefully this time next year Maybe this time next year, right? Okay, by this time next year, we want to have a geocache in all seven cities. And we want to encourage y'all to pass the word, to plan to come back when we have all of our seven cities and all the ones in between, because we will have a big point at the end so that if you do all seven of our trails all over the county, one of our cities used to have a gold mine, so we already know we're going to do a gold mine trail up in the northern part of the county. So we have a lot of plans, but remember this, none of our plans would have come true to fruition had it not been for our introduction to folks like y'all. We have discovered what wonderful people geocachers are. Y'all are about the most... Y'all are without a doubt some of the friendliest, nicest, congenial folks I've ever run into, and besides that, y'all know how to throw down and dance, <laughs> and you darn show sure know how to dress up in these cute clothes. I told somebody, that's the kind of thing I'd like to wear to work. Where'd you get that? <laughs> so again, welcome. All of our merchants, as the mayor said, all of our merchants are ready for y'all. They've got welcome signs in their doors. They've got, they've got a launch sign about the Geo Avengers that's coming in the spring. They are ready to take care of you today. Our community is ready to take care of you today. And if there is anything that you need, other than, you know, some kind of weird costume, then we are here to help you. So welcome, welcome, welcome. We are so excited. We can't stand it. Thank you. To at least uh, Jim and I and the crew, uh, we love it here. Now we're going to get down to why you're um, all standing here right now holding your little pieces of paper. If you printed out a log, we have a special pad tag that the City of Warm Springs uh, generously uh, produced for us to hand out. There's uh, several of the crew members with aprons. Let's all line up. I've got about seven of them. We can make seven lines and make this real quick. 